Now we are going to investigate a modified version of interferometer. The half mirror as beam splitter is replaced by a vertically oriented polarizer. The receiver shows no microwave signal. Adding a mirror in the path of the transmitter or receiver doesn't make any difference. Let's rotate the transmitter to horizontal orientation. We can't see the difference by adding a mirror. The receiver shows no signal even when it's oriented horizontally. Let's rotate the transmitter to 45 degree orientation. The receiver still shows no signal. Now let's replace the mirror with 45 degree polarizer. This time the receiver shows a weak signal when it's in the path of the transmitter. But no signal when it's in the path of the receiver. Now the polarizer as beam splitter is rotated to horizontal orientation. This time the receiver shows a weak signal when it's in the path of the receiver. but no signal when it's in the path of the transmitter. Let's replace the beam splitter with 45 degree polarizer. The orientation of the transmitter is perpendicular to the polarizing beam splitter. A vertical polarizer is placed in the transmitter path. The receiver shows a weak signal. Moving the polarizer slowly away from the beam splitter makes the signal strength fluctuates. It also happens when the polarizing mirror is oriented horizontally, although the signal looks weaker. When the polarizing mirror is placed in the receiver path, the receiver shows no signal, no matter how the polarizer is oriented. 